Hello Scorpio, welcome to your weekly reading. So Scorpio, I'm going to do messages for the month of February. We're going to see what you can expect. Um, of course, the energy can carry on beyond February. This is general, so not everything will resonate. Take what does and leave the rest. Definitely come back to see how much applied. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, as well as Jupiter. So check your other placements as well. And let's tap in and see what Spirit has to say. Spirit, give me some energy for Scorpio. What's the message? Messages for Scorpio. What's the energy? February messages. What's the energy, Spirit? The Fool, but this is the Shadow side. Aquarius energy, and then we have the Tower. So I feel like somebody um doesn't listen. They don't want to listen. Scorpio, this Tower is your energy. There could be something about confusion. I'm hearing in the midst of confusion. Let's go ahead and tap in and see what's the reading about. What's your energy? Spirit, tell me about the fool. Yeah, I'm just getting like confusion. There's like something about confusion going on for you, Scorpio. Or this could be happening to somebody that's energetically tied to you. Why is the fool here? For Scorpio, what's the message? I have the Seven of Pentacles. Yeah, it's like somebody's waiting on something, but they didn't listen. Somebody's hard-headed. Like somebody just wanted to do things their way, and it's not working out. Thank you, Spirit. So I feel like there's some confusion going on when it comes to you, or this could be an energy around you, but it's like somebody wanted to do something their way, and it's just not working out. Somebody didn't trust their intuition didn't want to listen didn't follow divine guidance the ace of pentacles and we have the sun in the reverse yeah so i feel like for some of you this has to do with resources finances seven of pentacles to the ace eight of pentacles it's like somebody's working for something but they're not satisfied with the results somebody's very unhappy leo energy tell me more about the seven of pentacles Yep, something's hard. Something is a burden. It is challenging. Give me another energy for the Seven of Pentacles. Why is the Seven of Pentacles here for Scorpio? The Four of Swords. Yeah, it's like somebody's praying for something. Somebody asks for something. But it's like they're taking the hardest path. They're taking the most difficult path when it was meant to be easier. The tower. Something was just meant to run smoothly. It was going to be an easy transition. But somebody wants to... Take the hard way out. And they're learning a lesson about that. Give me an energy for the Ten of Wands. Or you are. Why is the Ten of Wands here for Scorpio? What's the message? Four of Pentacles. Yeah, I'm telling you, somebody's struggling financially. I feel like somebody's praying for some type of help, assistance. But it's like this person did it to themselves or you did it to yourself. Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? Yeah, somebody's very dissatisfied or will be very dissatisfied with the outcome. I have the Ace of Swords. So we have two Aces. Give me another energy for the Ace of Pentacles. I feel like the truth is, whenever this Ace of Pentacles opportunity presented itself, somebody wasn't happy with it. Um, somebody felt like they could do better. I'm hearing greed. Somebody could have wanted more. But somebody wasn't appreciative. Give me another energy for the Ace of Pentacles. Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? For Scorpio, what's the energy? Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? The Page of Cups. I feel like somebody came with good intentions. But it just wasn't enough for this person. Um, they didn't see the value in you scorpio for some of you this could be somebody not seeing a value in the friendship you was offering them relationship advice somebody just did not see the value in it even though you came with good intentions you um were the truth you were the light but somebody just wanted to do things their own way give me another energy for the ace of Pen the ace of swords why is the ace of swords here for scorpio what's the energy why is the Ace of Swords here for Scorpio? What's the message spirit? The Six of Swords. Oh, yeah. You were divinely led to this person. Yes. 
God put you in this um, masculine or, or feminist life for a reason. This is something that happened in the past. Six of Cups. Give me another energy for the Page of Cups. I feel like you were meant to help this person, assist this person. But somebody kind of like, you know, pushed you away. Didn't want what you were offering. Give me an energy for the Page of Cups. Why is the Page of Cups here for Scorpio? What's the energy? The Knight of Cups. I'm telling you, you came with genuine intentions. You really did. For some of you, somebody could have questioned your intentions, questioned your motive. Give me an energy for the Sun in the reverse. Why is the Sun in the reverse here for Scorpio? What's the energy? The Moon in the reverse. Cancer Pisces energy. Somebody just really didn't trust their their intuition. And this sun in the reverse is giving me like hard-headed. Like somebody's so hard-headed, they don't care. Um, somebody also would have needed to go through like a rebirth and awakening. Somebody would have had to change. They don't want to do that. Somebody just likes being the way they are. Give me an energy for the sun in the reverse. The ace of cups. Intemperance. You were sent in to be a blessing to this person. To show genuine love and compassion. For some of you, you were sent in to be in a partnership with this energy. Some of you are chosen earth angels, divine. You come with a lot of spiritual gifts, very intuitive. Your cup overflows. You have a lot of love, compassion to give. And, and somebody just threw that away. Threw your love away. Um, if you came into this person's life to be a friend, a companion, give advice, they just toss that to the side. Why is the moon in the reverse here? And now somebody's paying for it. Why is the moon in the reverse here for Scorpio? Or they will. Somebody could have Sagittarius, highly aspected, but hey man, now somebody's stuck. They don't know what to do. They can't even get a prayer in. They, I'm hearing a breakthrough. Somebody praying for a breakthrough, but... The breakthrough already came through. Somebody ignored it. It wasn't good enough. It wasn't shiny enough. It wasn't what they expected. Somebody ignored their own intuition. So you're praying for something that you have already received. You just didn't value it. You didn't see it at the time. And so that's why this person is in this Ten of Wands, Seven of Pentacles waiting. Somebody's waiting is in vain. Give me an energy for the Fool. Why is the fool here for Scorpio? What's the energy? The seven of swords. Somebody has to accept the truth. That they just didn't listen. They, they took a leap and really did not follow proper instruction spiritually. Somebody just ignored, ignored what was right in front of them. Somebody has to accept the truth. As this person is waiting in the Seven of Pentacles, they have no other choice but to accept the truth. Ten of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. You were somebody's ten. You were meant to work with this person, build with this person. Romantic, platonic. You and this person were meant to come together. But they just refused. They didn't want to see it. They didn't want to hear it. And now they have to accept the truth about the choice they made. About the leak they took. Give me an energy for the tower. Give me something for this Ace of Cups because it's standing out. Why is the Ace of Cups here for Scorpio? The Hermit. I'm telling you, you're wise. Wise counsel. Somebody ignored wise counsel. You had a lot to feed this person. A lot of information. A lot that would have helped them. I'm hearing jealous for some of you. This person could have um, decided to move away from you. Not to listen to you out of jealousy. Virgo energy on the Hermit. Give me a message for the Tower. Why is the tower here? The nine of swords. I'm hearing warning. Somebody ignored all the warnings. And it's like instead of um this tower being something positive, somebody thought they were going to get a positive tower. That's what this is, but they didn't. They got the ten of wands. Somebody thought something was going to turn out better than it did, but it didn't. And that's why this person is stressed out. Give me a final message for Scorpio or you are. Give me a final energy for this reading spirit. What's the message? Give me a final energy for this reading. 
What is the message? The Ten of Cups. You and somebody's ten. Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles, Ace of Wands. We have all four Aces. Ace of Swords, Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Cups, Ace of Wands. I'm telling you, this person is going to be blessed. Highly favored. This is going to be a major transition in this masculine or feminist life. All they had to do was get on board, follow direction, not be hard-headed, take the leap, trust the process, operate by faith. This was meant to be their 10, their wish fulfillment. You're meant to be a blessing in disguise. Thank you, Spirit. You are a blessing in disguise. Somebody needed to look a little bit deeper, not be, I'm hearing, shallow, vain, not being greedy, expecting more. Not being judgmental, not thinking the grass is greener, not just trying to do it another way. Just really surrendering. And this person didn't want to do that. But this was meant to be a new cycle, a new beginning that was going to bring this person a lot of happiness or bring you a lot of happiness. But for some of you, it was just conflict. It was a lot of conflict. This person brought a lot of conflict to your life. But I feel like now that's their beginning. The five of wands, the five of wands, hardship, conflict, a struggle, having to fight their way through everything. Things are going to be like, thank you, spirit, 10 times harder, 10 of wands. Things are going to be 10 times harder for this person. For some of you, this was somebody that chose to deal with the queen of wands in reverse of third party. Somebody who um, Pretty much could only offer this masculine or feminine passion. That's it. This is a karmic energy. Somebody chose to put you in competition with this person. Somebody didn't have any self-control. And they missed out greatly. Ten of Pentacles again. Two of Wands. Somebody was supposed to be on the right path, but they're not. Somebody chose for some of you to commit to a karmic. Somebody who's not stable, not dependable. So, this is your reading, Scorpio. Take what resonates. Stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Stay blessed.